Hello everyone, welcome to Math is Fun. Our lesson for today is all about estimating and using appropriate units of measure for volume. Before we're going to discuss how to estimate and use appropriate units of measure for volume, let's define first what is a measurement. Measurement involves comparison. If we want to measure length, we need a measuring device to compare with. A measuring device, like ruler, contains small units such as millimeters and centimeters. Other devices have bigger units like meters and kilometers. Small units are used to measure small things and bigger units are used to measure larger things. What is a volume? Volume measures capacity. For example, the volume of a bowl is the amount of space or how much water is inside. In the metric system of measurement, the most common units of volume are milliliters and liters. How big is a milliliter? A single raindrop contains about one milliliter of liquid. It is also the same as a little cube that one centimeter on each side. One cubic centimeter is equal to one milliliter. How big is liter? A bottle contains about a liter of liquid. 1,000 cubic centimeters is equal to 1 liter. The appropriate unit to use when measuring volume is based on the problem. For liquids that requires big container, you use liters, but for small containers or small amounts of liquids, use milliliters. However, there are other units that are being used that we can see everywhere such as cubic inches, cubic feet, gallon, pint, quarter, and many more. One cubic meter is equal to 1,000 liters. To understand fully our topic for today, let's study the following examples. Which is closer to the volume of a water bottle as shown in the picture below. Is it 750 liters or 750 milliliters? What is your answer? Yes, you are right. The answer is 750 milliliters. 750 milliliters is less than 1 liter, so it can fill in this water bottle. Another example. Which is closer to the volume of an aquarium as shown in the picture below? Is it 22 liters or 22 milliliters? What is your answer? Very good! The answer is 22 liters. An aquarium needs more water, so 22 liters can fill in an aquarium. Next example, which is closer to the volume of a bowl as shown in the picture below? Is it 500 milliliters or 500 liters? What is your answer? Fantastic! The correct answer is 500 milliliters. 500 milliliters is less than 1 liter, so it can fill in this bowl. I hope that you understand our lesson for today, and thank you for watching.